Over in Russia, one of the suspects responsible for an explosion that went off in a subway train in St. Petersburg has been identified. While the city declared three days to mourn the loss of lives, the motives for the attack are yet to be determined. Cho Song Min reports. The suspect behind the metro bombing in St. Petersburg that killed at least 14 and injured more than 50 people has been identified. Kyrgyz authorities working jointly with Moscow revealed on Tuesday that CCTV images showed 22-year-old Akbaron Zalilov, a Russian citizen born in Kyrgyzstan, to be author of the attack. The motives for the attack are yet to be determined, and although nobody has claimed responsibility for the bombing, there is rising speculation that the attack intended to deliver a message as the suspect was known to be closely linked with radical Islamist groups. Russia's state investigative committee said chances are high that the attack was suicidal in nature as parts of Jalilov's body were found in one of the train carriages. Russian Prime Minister Dmitry Medvedev defined the incident as an act of terrorism and Kremlin has backed the statement by saying the suicide bombing is a challenge to President Vladimir Putin who was in St. Petersburg on the day of the explosion. Moscow's National Anti-Terrorist Committee said the bomb was detonated at around 2.20 p.m. on Monday local time on a subway train headed to Senaya Ploshat station. The explosive device was reportedly concealed in a bag along with a fire extinguisher. After the subway was hit with the blast, a larger explosive device was found in one of the fire extinguishers in another station, but it was defused by police. The city of St. Petersburg declared three days of mourning, while Russian President Vladimir Putin, who was born in St. Petersburg, visited one of the memorials on Monday to lay roses and offered his condolences to the relatives of the victims. Cho Song-min, Arirang News.